Hello, I'm Juanita Rajpal at the Auditorium Stravinsky at the Montreux Jazz Festival. Right now on stage, sound checks are taking place for music legends such as Quincy Jones and Herbie Hancock. On this edition of Icon, we will take you to iconic places and meet iconic faces in the world of music. And we will see how music has inspired great art and classic design. Guitar Hero, the heir to the throne of the air guitar. I soon have a chance to find out whether or not I have it during my first lesson on a rather special guitar. You have to try the blues, the blues lick, okay? okay. Swiss watchmaker Parmigiani has brought along a couple of Fender Telecasters encrusted with semi-precious stones, so if my solos don't sparkle, at least my instrument will. Very important to bend the notes in the blues, for example this one, and then you bend the notes like... If I'm ever going to follow in the footsteps of the great guitarists who have played Montreux, such as Eric Clapton, Carlos Santana, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Jeff Beck, and Mark Knopfler, clearly I'm going to need plenty of practice. I could also use a guitar of my own. For oh my CNN. <laughs> what do you think of that? That is absolutely beautiful. And. There's more than one way of becoming a musical icon. You could spend years honing your musical chops so you get to perform at major music festivals like at Montreux, or you could design the world's best-selling electric guitar. But in the modern day, there's an easier way. Queen's Bohemian Rhapsody is among the most recent additions to Guitar Hero. We've come to Santa Monica, California for a sneak preview of the latest version of Guitar Hero, Warriors of Rock. The game allows frustrated guitarists to emulate their heroes. For the price of a cheap seat at a rock arena, I can take my place on stage as a musical avatar and test my talent against the best. But at the root of it is a fix for lovers of air guitar, a kind of karaoke for instrumentalists. Nice one. You made it. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at the numbers. And for some of those kids, they may have never even really heard of the bands that uh, oh, are yeah. featured. Oh yeah, that happens all the time. I mean, for many rock musicians, the Gibson Custom Guitar Factory in Nashville is one of the world's most iconic locations. This is the place which gives birth to instruments which end up in the hands of budding guitar heroes the world over. And we're going to show you the creation of a very special guitar for Icon. I think we have a very special That's guitar. Gorgeous. For oh my CNN. <laughs> what do you think of that? That is absolutely beautiful. <laughs>